Oh, hey guys. Now, I was just chilling up in the uh, Four Music HQ and I heard a little rumour that Selena Gomez is in London. Now, she's only in town for a couple of days, but it is too good an opportunity to miss. So I've hired a suite in the Langham Hotel and we're just going to hang out. Should be a laugh. <laughs> Hotel in London. I've got a suite in there and I'm gonna have a little chat with Selena. We've got about 45 minutes with her because as you can see, she's in the middle of a big press tour. Let's go in. The suite's on the first floor, so come on. 583. The Regent Suite. So apparently she's going to be here in like two minutes, so I think I'm ready. Hello! Hello, Selena. Hello. How are you? I'm wonderful. Good. In you come. Look at this. Yeah. Pretty, pretty swanky, right? What have I done to deserve such a You've just, presentation? Just, just coming to join me. I, I usually have to bribe people with all kinds of treats to even speak to me. It's quite well, expensive aw. being me. I'm going to have a cup of tea. Do that. Because I haven't actually had any tea yet. Okay. It still feels quite early. I am very jet lagged. But you've been up since like silly o'clock. About 5 a.m., yeah, but I was in Paris and yeah, I'm a little tired, not going to lie. You know what's really embarrassing? There's no milk. Oh, do we need it? Oh, is, well, is you can't. Is there any milk, guys? Is there any? Unprofessional. Joe, Joe, where's the milk? Damn um, it, Joe. I'm okay without milk. I'm you're, fine. You're going for it. No, I'm fine. This is, wow. I mean, it's good for your throat, right? Yeah. So, Paris. Mm -hmm. Let's talk about Paris. Okay. Because this is quite prison. We've got macaroons. I know. I in honor of your this. little sojourn to Paris. I know. How, how was it? It was really cool. Yeah, mm. I had a great time. I've only been to Fashion Week twice. And Twice more than me. <laughs> Don't worry about it. <laughs> well, that's wicked. And obviously, you've probably been talking a lot today about the lift. Oh, yeah, a little bit. Did you hear that? Phone went off. Is that yours? No, it's actually, it's actually producer <laughs> Joe's phone. Um, Joe. Oh, look, it's a, it's a creative director. Joe is just... He's, he's just the, the head of the channels, just <laughs> literally text you, mate. You, I'll, I'll, I won't Are read it. Are you in it. trouble? Yeah, he's in big trouble. How would you put it on? Sorry. Yeah, so the lift thing, come on. That was, mm. that, was it awful? Is it it was pretty, well, let's be honest, if I was in there for maybe 20 more minutes, mm. I wouldn't have filmed it or have yeah. even, I was only filming it so that I could distract myself. It was very tight. We keep talking. Yeah, 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 open the door like that. No, no, I'm not getting out like that. Is there any way you can... If it's a key... Oh, wait, it just be one of these things. Fight. <gasps> <gasps> I couldn't really tell that, that well from the video, but it I, looks like a proper I small have, lift. I have a longer video that I have of it because I couldn't believe it. Yeah. The, the elevator was made for three people and oh, we basically no. fit seven people in it. So is that why it broke? Yeah, oh, we God. broke it. So I'm sorry for everybody yeah. who lives at that apartment uh, yeah. building. That's, that's terrifying because the scary thing though is then when you like climb out between the floors because if it was to drop... I know. Oh wait, that's it. see that's so frightening. I know we did it we did a, a swift jump. Yeah, yeah, yeah. It was impressive. Oh. It was you were you were very brave. Thank I was, you. I, I thought it was amazing. Before that, mm -hmm. what I'd really noticed on your social media, my favorite thing on your social media was the video of when Bad Blood won the Grammy. Oh and you you went completely bonkers. What? Normally, when people win an award, they can't go that crazy because they're in the room with all the people that have lost. Oh, that's the political. <laughs> yeah, exactly. Like, oh, oh well, I'm oh sort of gosh. vaguely pleased, but I, you know, Don't. but you were able just to like absolutely let loose. It was really cool. I mean, it's such a it's such a cool thing to be a part of when you know she's been my best friend for ten years, yeah. and I remember when she called me and was talking about the video idea. And to be honest, she'd say it herself. We were all in the room watching the pre-show and. We're like, oh, there's no way you're going to win this. Because yeah. there was some really good videos. Yeah, they yeah. were all amazing, obviously. Yeah. We're like, oh, you're not going to win. So when it happened, it was the crazy. It was so genuine yeah. because I think we had already written it off in a way. Yeah, and I was yeah. just, 
It was cool though. It was great because there was so much heart that was put into that. So, like, how glamorous really are those award ceremonies, though? And, like, the grand... Because it looks amazing, everybody looks amazing, but is there an atmosphere of, kind of, everybody's a little bit nervous, everybody... Do people really want to be there? Probably not. Really? <laughs> really? I don't know. I can't speak for everybody. It's situational. I think yeah. you work so hard to, to, to create something that everybody will appreciate. All of these people who've come together and they've created different styles of music. Yeah. But then, you know, there are some times where you're just, it's just like chaotic and unorganized maybe. And yeah. they're rushing because it's live and yeah. people are being thrown around and stepped on. That part yeah. is Wow. Not you that don't fun. see that. Um, but speaking of creating amazing things, Revival. It's an amazing thing. <laughs> Yay! And it's done you. incredibly, incredibly well. You must be over the moon. Very. But I'm already actually in the studio working on the next one, so... Really? Yeah. So you can't just totally enjoy... I'm touring this, so I'm, I'm very proud of it. Yeah. And I'll be with this album for a while, but this was a very important year for me. It was mm. such a transition period, and I had to be very honest with myself, most importantly, mm. and go in and figure out what my lane was going to be. I mm. had been in music for a while, but I didn't know if I really had a defining moment as an artist, to mm. be real, because it's... I, I always thought, okay, if I can't reach this note, I must not be a great singer. If I can't sing this type of music, I must not be a great singer, and I completely had it all wrong. I wasn't... Mm even remotely confident enough to realize that that has nothing to do with yeah. music. It's about translating something that people feel and yeah. emotions and whether it's a pop song, because I'm fully 100% a pop artist, but mm. I, I want it to still have meaning behind it. Mm. Yeah, 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 which, which, it, which it definitely does. Mm -hmm. So that process of, of making that transition and, and choosing your lane, how, how kind of difficult was that? I started over. I got a new label, yeah. new agency new management, and it was a weird that's time. That's a tough de decision to make. Yeah, but that's I think brave. that's when the greatness comes, is yeah. when you're kind of forced to challenge yourself or yeah. get out of your bubble. And I was just chilling. I was so comfortable in my area. I was yeah, like, yeah. I am fine. I'm not going anywhere. And I just, I couldn't do it. There was so much chaos and noise around me. And, you know, the whole world had an opinion mm. suddenly on what my life was and yeah. I, my work started disappearing and my personal life was becoming the forefront mm. and that was never my plan ever so it it, it forced me to get my <laughs> together <laughs> i was yeah, like yeah. i i need to i need to say something because yeah. i'm i'm feeling so much and i can't just give these people the satisfaction of not even they have no idea what i'm feeling and that's yeah. what i wanted revival to be but i suppose that's what artistry is all about as well isn't it because p as people everybody changes and evolves all the time. Mm -hmm. The thought that like you release an album and then that is your sound forever right, right. is a, is kind of absurd. Yeah, and you know, growing up in it is also weird because yeah. you're you're young and people already put you in a box. They're yeah. just like you're young, you're this, you're you you're associated. Well, I, I feel like I've fair. broken out of it though, so I'm box. fine. <laughs> you are out of the box, Feels loving good. life.